everyone, I am Stevie Hahn, a real estate agent here in Jacksonville, Florida. Today's video, I wanted to share with you how I received each one of these listings. I've got seven listings that are closing in the month of October 2019. And I just wanted to come on here and share with you, I made a video on my Instagram story, which my Instagram handle is at sold by Stevie. And I shared with everyone because I get asked a lot. How do they get listings? How do I personally get listings? So I made this Instagram video and I got a ton of engagement on it. So I wanted to create this video for everyone else. So um, I wanted to share that if you're wanting now business, I truly believe that you should be calling for sale by owners, expired listings, and circle prospecting. Uh, currently, I do not implement that in my business, to be honest with you. I honestly have built up this referral business, essentially, and have built up my social media that I truly feel like it brings me a lot of credibility. So I'm going to share with you uh, in detail about each listing. And real quick, I know this is about listings, but I want to share, I do have three buyers that we are um, currently under contract and I want to share real quickly on how I received those, those buyers. Right now I'm more listing heavy and that's what this video is geared towards, but these three buyers, um, the first one, I had received a referral from past customers. They purchased a proper property with me about two years ago and they had told their coworker about me. Um, the next one, the second one, uh, they actually had came into an open house that I was hosting and now we are under contract with their new home. And the third person, uh, they had reached out to me, the wife had reached out to me on Instagram. I believe she had looked up hashtag Jacksonville Realtor, or Jacksonville Real Estate, and she came across my profile and now we are under contract uh, under contract on their new home. Okay, but this is about listings, so I'm gonna share with you in detail about those. So the first two on my board, Aries and Clovis, actually just closed today, this morning, and how I received this was actually from Zillow. I do not pay for Zillow, I don't pay for realtor.com realtor either, but um, not really sure how Essentially, she found me on Zillow, but she had reached out to me and she had two properties actually that she wanted to sell, um, but only was going to let me list one of them. She had somebody who was interested in buying the other property, an investor who was going to do cash. And actually, I ended up running the numbers for her and I felt really confident that I could get her more money than what that investor was offering. Um, so she actually ended up letting me list both of those properties and they closed today. So this was, that was from Zillow. I don't know if Zillow is teasing me um, to try to get me to buy in and pay leads with them, but she had reached out to me on Zillow. I really do try to have a good Zillow profile. Um, I try to have reviews on there. Like we just closed on our property today and I sent her the link to write up a review for me. Um, also having a good close up photo I heard was really beneficial. Make, sh make sure that you have a bio. Um, so that's a couple things. I try to make sure that my Zillow is up to date. So maybe that's how I got her. Um, but anyways, the next property is um, Ellipse. It's my Georgetown uh, listing that I have. And I actually listed this property for rent about three years ago. I received this referral from one of my coworkers. Um, I guess they didn't want to list the property themselves for rent because you don't really make that much money off of them compared to selling uh, the property, right? So I ended up listing it for rent, which I do this for homeowners all the time. I love the process. We put it on the MLS, we do the photos, we do a background credit, to check, we write up the lease, we find a really qualified tenant for the homeowner. So that's what I did for this Georgetown listing three years ago. And they had the same tenant all three years. Those tenants finally ended up moving out and they thought of me to list their house because I kept in touch with them over three years. And so they allowed me the opportunity to list the home. What's really cool about this that I will mention is as soon as I listed that property in this neighborhood, several listings came up on the market in there. And so it was really competitive and it's a super small neighborhood. 
and I had it on the market for a little over a month and um, Lindsay who we had connected on Instagram we had never actually met in person until recently but uh, we had connected on Instagram we had talked several times and she ended up having a buyer who she thought might be interested in Georgetown there are several listings for sale on there the whole time I had it listed nothing went under contract um, and so there's about eight or nine listings in there I believe and she only showed her customer my listing and it ended up being perfect for him um, essentially she showed it to him because she knew me she knew me from Instagram she wanted to show my listing it worked out for the buyer and she didn't show him anywhere else so I just felt like that was so really the next cool. listing that I have on her contract is my Jacksonville Beach condo listing essentially I received this referral from a girl that I went to high school with, I went to college with her out in Gainesville, and then we ended up moving back to Jacksonville. She started dating this guy, and he ended up getting a job in North Carolina. So they moved to North Carolina, they had the property, tenant occupied for about two years, and then he decided that he wanted to sell it, and she had told her boyfriend about me, which is really cool because I have not spoken to her in many, many years, but we are connected on social media so I truly feel like if I haven't been posting on there and staying as active as I am she probably would have never thought of me. okay so the next listing that I have in her contract is a beautiful four-bedroom home with a pool and I had received this referral from another real estate agent she is a friend of mine who lives in Palm Coast and we decided to co-list the property together so I got this listing from another real estate agent Okay, so my next listing that I have under contract is my Rayborn listing. So I had received a phone call one day, I was out driving and she ended up telling me that she needed to sell her house. The tenants had just moved out, it was her investment property and she had cleaned it up, she was ready to go, asked if I serviced the area and how quickly I could get over there. So I was out driving, I told her I could be there in two hours. I just needed to pop into one of our exit offices so I could run some numbers. I created a net sheet for her, I grabbed my seller guide, I also grabbed the lockbox and the sign because she sounded right Ready, so I wanted to be ready too. went out to the property I got the listing I asked her who had referred her to me because I would love to thank them and she ended up telling me that um, she googled real estate agents in Jacksonville and somehow I came up I wish I had a real legitimate reasoning or uh, strategy of how that happened because I have no idea um, so essentially she had found me online. okay last listing is my Bartram Springs property that's under contract I had received a message from my website it contacts me if anyone comes through and registers he went to the site registered mentioned that he had this Bartram Springs property that he wanted to sell I called him I had a listing appointment out of the property the next day and I got the listing and I had asked him how had he heard of me me and he said from social media so we are connected on LinkedIn and Instagram so I thought that was really cool that that listing had come from social media okay so that wraps up the video of how I received each one of my listings seven closings in the month of October really exciting and then how I had received the other three buyer listings so real quick if you like this video please like it comment below subscribe I'm gonna be posting a video every single week and we have a mastermind call every Wednesday 7 p.m. Eastern if you want to jump on that otherwise I will be uploading it to my YouTube channel but if you want to get on the live free mastermind call on Wednesdays comment below your email address so I can get you added to that list and I can send you the link for you to hop on um, other than that if you know of anybody looking to buy or sell real estate in the Jacksonville area you can go to my website steviehan.com I have access to all properties even new construction we can connect on LinkedIn Facebook Instagram uh, my Instagram handle again is at soul by Stevie um, you can email me Stevie at steviehan.com and that wraps up this video let me know if you like it and I hope you guys have a great day